record. Is it on? So can you see the blingage real good? Okay, guys, so real quick, these, these were from a store called Scrapbook Closeout. Scrapbook Closeout. And these were 50 cents, so of course, when I buy letters, I buy two of each, just because I feel like I never have enough. So, let me... Here we go. That's the red. These. Yeah, I'm recording. Honey. These. Just so you guys know, he went with me, <laughs> and he was a real good sport about it. Carried all the bags. These are all bling, bling letters. I think they're real, real, real cute. So got those. Um, the brads were a buck. These were 50 cents each. What? I'm going to put it right here. Okay, these were 50 cents each. Um, the brads were a buck. The store that I wanted to get the bling from, I didn't know they were doing an early bird special on Saturday. So I missed it. But that's all right, because I know for next time. Okay, so the brads, clouds. These Jolies. I really don't need this, but I bought it because it's Jolies and they're expensive and they were only 50 cents. So, um, these little wood flower veneers. This blingage I got, it's called Glitterazzi. And I got them because of how fine. Can you see it? There's the, it's so petite. The, it, it's just really just so petite and I thought you know what if it doesn't work for me I can always give them away for 50 cents what the hell <laughs> um, I got these I don't really like them they were just there <laughs> because that's the thing with the scrapbooking and the scrapbook expo I was like I don't really like it but you know what I'm grabbing everything oh, that's so cute. yeah these are three different frames that's cute I love this color so Pearls, gotta have the pearls. Every self-respecting scrapbooker should have <coughs> adhesive pearls. Um, these are real pretty. These are, I guess, little friends, whatever. Pink pearls. Play. Boys will be boys. Beautiful. <sighs> Drama queen. <laughs> Hollywood. I think I might even have this one. Didn't you buy me this one one time, honey? Didn't you buy me this before? I could swear I have this. Whatever. Anyway, 50 cents. Yeah, something similar to that. Girl. Another girl. Um, I got the boxing stickers. He picked these out. Right. Because they're boxing stickers. Yay. Oh, they're cute. Oh, you can't see them. Yeah, boxing now we stickers. can. Stickers. Um, and then these here with the X's were four, four dollar. So they're just triangles. Mm. So I got those because they were four, four dollar. And then I got the blingy skulls. Can't see those. The blingy skulls. I got these actually for a friend of mine. So I'm not keeping those. <laughs> I, I already told you guys I don't do Halloween too much. Just, just, just way too much drama. Um, and then these were two for a dollar. These little. That one says ten cent, right? This is like a ten cent stamp. <laughs> that was cute. Um, Two for a dollar, these the buttons. And then I got in the same store, so they had a big pack. I think everybody that went to the expo out here or ever in their life saw these. They have a big gigantic bag of breads. And what are you doing? Why are you moving that? Turning it. There's no need for you to turn it. And these are numbers. So they had this big gigantic bag for five bucks. And then she was just real super nice. So she gave them to me for three bucks. So it's just brads after brads. These are Christmas brads. The whole bag is Christmas brads. And then all of these brads <laughs> and these brads dropping them oh, no. so when I say brads I mean brads brads for days brads 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 yeah. so this was from scrapbook closeout and then this here was from paper wishes I do remember that it's amazing how it's all coming back to me oh. 
This was from Paper Wishes. They had the nicest stuff there, didn't they, honey? Yes, they did. The, all that <laughs> laser cutting stuff. You have to build these, though. Like, they're not taped together. Oh. But, man, oh, man, are they real Can't cute. And I was real excited because they just... It's hard for me to find Puerto Rico stuff. I think that's cute. And then there's the Morro of San Juan. See that? There you go. Sort of. I don't know what all this. Oh, those are cannons. And the, I don't know. I've seen that statue like before. It's like Chiquita and Banana stuff. something. I don't know. Chiquita Banana wasn't ours. Um, and then the flag. And there's some stuff tucked under here too. Oh my goodness. That is too cute. What's what is in there? This? I don't know. Oh, these are the other pieces. So you got to build them. And then the flag. Oh, okay. okay. That's that. <laughs> so this was from Paper Wishes. And these were, what, $7.99 for one of them? My machine can do this. But, you know, it looks so much better when... <laughs> it's like food when you go to a restaurant. Like, yeah, you can stay home and cook. But it tastes so much better when you don't have to cook it and clean after it. <laughs> so this looks so much cuter when I didn't have to make it and pick up the mess. Um, okay, so that's from Paper Wishes. I'm going to try to do this quickly. Yeah. These were from, I don't remember. You know what? If I get the map, get the, give me that map that was in the, in, in the green bag. If I get the map, I'll know. So these little paper packs were a buck each. Yes, this. Yeah, six. So this was mm -hmm. from the paper law. Uh uh. Echo Park paper. Mm hmm. Oh. Uh. All the way in the back. Creativity Center. Echo Park paper, I'm pretty sure. If I'm wrong, then may so God forgive me. Um. So these were a dollar each, six by six paper pads. So I picked up four of those. I don't really use these small papers, but they were only a dollar. What, you know, what? They were a dollar. So I got them. And then from this same um, a vendor, there was a kit of 48 double-sided papers. And these were four bucks for, it was $4 for the whole thing. So those papers, They're just so, that's cool. all that I got from there, from that store. Was there anything else that I got from that store? No, there was nothing else from that store. Okay, so we'll get this out the way. Oh, um, oh actually from Scrapbook Closeouts, I also got this. Can you see this real good? Yeah. So this is like, it looks like this homemade kind of album album right and my daughter went to thailand um i don't know last year or something so she wanted me to scrapbook all of her pictures for her and i was waiting i didn't want to do it because i was waiting for something that would be the right look for those pictures and then she's got this wood uh, mm. like branches here and it has this thick twine and the camera doesn't look and as this, real uh, like crepe paper or whatever this is and then the pages in here they're almost like mulberry i'm not really sure what kind of material this is but they're just simple you can slide the pictures in i thought it was so cute for for her for those kinds of pictures See, and this is like straw or something so this almost feels like corn husk it's the weirdest thing. This, this, right, right here. It. Like, you know, this, the stuff on the Maybe corn? Bamboo. Corn This bamboo. But, Maybe. okay. Can you hear me, corn husk? This flower is pretty. still hungry. Um, so, <laughs> like, um, so this was cute. And this was only five bucks. So I thought that was cute. That was from this store here. This, all this stuff here. The flowers are Oh, and from this store, I also got... Uh, I don't know. I got this one for <laughs> old guy's rule. <laughs> so, my baby. 
I thought it was cute because it came with all of this uh, stickerage here with the trophy husband and then you oh, got that some. Shows up clean. Yeah, I know it's cheesy, but I thought it was cute. So again, that's all from this store, from this place, and this was uh, scrapbooking closeouts. Yeah, scrapbooking closeouts. So this was the floor plan. Okay, moving right along. This was from Lickety Splits. Look at these splits, and she sells already made uh, kits. Kits for layouts. So I just this I got this as the make and take. I think it was two dollars to do a make and take, except that I didn't make it there. So and this is the layout. It was cute. It was only two bucks, you know, whatever. So that was from Lickety Splits, and then this was from Scrap That. Um, scrap That. We've been, we were singing that all day, right, honey? Scrap that. All on the floor. Scrap that. No? Okay. The name of the so, booth is this, Scrap That? <laughs> yeah. That's so this funny. was from Scrap That. This was um, a paper kit they put together. I got it because it has a lot of glittery stuff. And I like to can't really see sparkle. It, so that was from Scrap That. Also from Scrap That, I got... Uh, these papers here and these papers were 33 cents each so because I have OCD I always buy two papers of the same kind and they're double-sided oh, so that's, that's that um, I got this because it has the bingo thing there and it's sparkly you know <laughs> you can't beat the sparkle and that's the back of it and I love double-sided paper <laughs> and this because I like it that it looks like craft paper and I like craft paper too. I'm such a brown kind of chick sometimes. <laughs> and these, these are Christmas papers, I think, because it says all is bright. All is bright. Maybe snow. Mm -hmm. Okay, so those were 33 cents each and I also got those from Scrap That. Except for the first bunch that I showed you, those were in a kit that he had put together. And that was, I think, five bucks. And from Scrap That, I also got... You should zoom out. Why? Because it's, like, really close. You can't see it? Can. Okay. So, score tapes. Lots and lots and lots of score tapes. Um, I had some score tapes that I sent out to someone that I know. And then I went back to buy more score tapes to a store called Daiso's. And turns out that they're not going to have any for six weeks. So I saw them at Scrap That. The guy had them for the same price, $1.50 each. I got all different kinds of sizes and dun. I took advantage dun, of the dun, fact that dun. I was able to get a bunch of them. Um, so I'm real happy about that. And let me see what else. So this was. Okay, so now, this I have to attribute to Miss Vicky, who is Mila Fano over here on YouTube. And um, she, sh she made a video, I, I don't know how long ago she made the video because I just, I just found this amazing woman. So, um, so I got, <laughs> she did, she, were, she made a video about these things called mud puddles. <laughs> so cute. It's like adhesive sand or something. Put it closer. Adorable. So. That looks like snow. This one, well, the one that looks like snow, this is snow sand. And it looks real pretty in the examples that they had there. Oh my god, that's so beautiful. And then this one's called Ivory Coast. And this one's real pretty too. This one's called Summer Mud Puddles. And that kind to me looks like real 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 sand yeah and then there's this red brick one and this is called um coconut, coconut sand so this is like a red bricky that look awesome on paper so they had a deal going on so you get you buy four of them and you get the tray the handy dandy uh brush. glue applicator brush and then you get these adhesive because they work really super good with these adhesive thickers um do it yourself thickers you, you you guys know about these you peel the paper off and it's adhesive and then you pour oh, the sand on there and, 
and it cool. looks real, real cute. So that's cool. So if you bought four, you got all this other stuff for free. Um, I bought four. However, my intention was to only keep these two and I was going to um, send these to Miss Vicky. So Miss Vicky, if you like these two colors, let me know and shoot me a PM and I'll mail them right out to you. So that's that. Yeah. And let's see. Okay, these papers were from. I don't even know where I got these papers from. I'm just like staring at the number eight ball Brad right there. I have no idea where these papers came from, but whatever. Uh, I don't know where these came from. So I got four of those, whatever that is. And then these, uh, these little dollar thingies. See, I, I'm a dollar shopper. I don't do like the super Ikea. magnificent prima stamps and not that you, you know you ladies that love them uh, I, I, I love them too i just you know i'm so cheap <laughs> and they are so pretty but i wouldn't know what to do with them if they came with instructions so you know i watch you guys making videos about them all the time and i'm like yeah but you gotta know how to use them for it to work and i don't really know what to do with them so i don't buy them this came from, I think this was Tall Mouse Creative Arts, or I don't know. I know that everything in there was a dollar, so I got these San Francisco. Ask him where it came from. And he wouldn't remember. And I got this dance, 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 dance. <laughs> and then just these little things. These were four, four buck, these little tags. What cute. Yeah, they're cute. Mi familia. Mi familia. My Mi family. So they were four for a dollar. Okay, oh wait, scrapbook closeout. You know, I did a lot of shopping at scrapbook closeout because they had like really, really cute stuff. And it was cheap. Okay, so I got the chipboard. These are Asian themed letters. Uh. They came in a kit. All of this came in a kit. So everything right here came in a kit. I totally get that. Letters borders. on letters. And I got black borders too. And these paper black borders. And they're like, what is this? Basil, basil card stock. So that's, this is also from Scrap of Clothes Out. And these pleated things. What are these? These are... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I don't know. There may be paper... I haven't opened them yet. I'm not going to open them because I don't want anybody yelling at me that I'm killing them with the crinkle. Um, so, <laughs> so, I keep getting in trouble, so I'm going to not, like, touch. don't crinkle. Anyway, and it came with this, two letters. So, these all came in a kit. And then these awesome papers. They're so pretty. And then, I don't know if the camera's picking it up, how mm -hmm. shiny and glittery they are. Now they are. So that's just really, really cute. And they're all double-sided. Oh, that, that's pretty. It looks like never, a lake. Yeah, I've never been to China, but I've been to Chinatown. So, you know, we can mm -hmm. make pretend. <laughs> and this is what? The Phoenix, right, honey, you said? The Phoenix? Mm -hmm. Karate man, no. Dun -dun. Karate man, know what he's talking about. And... What do you say, honey? Karate man, bleed from the inside. <laughs> and bang, bang. Bang, bang, karate man. Used all the shampoo. Bang, bang. Okay, stop it. <laughs> and these. So they're all really, really cute and glittery. I love glitter. If I see anything, it could, you know, it'd be crap. And if it had glitter on it, I'm like, I don't want it. It's so pretty. Oh, look at that pretty crap with glitter on it. <laughs> So that came from Scrapbook Closeout too. That was a kit. This is the kit. And then these papers came from Scrapbook Closeout too. So her deal was um, 20 cents a sheet. And she gave me more of those Asian, Asian themed papers for free. But um, so pretty stuff like this. These are like 
felt or something there, some kind of flocking or so that's Christmas. Um, fall papers. This is like real pretty graduation paper, glitter, glitter. I'm trying to do this fast, guys, because I know nobody wants to see this stuff. Everybody's interested in like the dies, and I didn't. Just so you guys know, I don't have a die cutting machine. Like I don't have a Sizzix, a Big Shot, a Spellbinder, a Vagabond, or any of those other other kinds of machines. I have an electronic. Del okay, I have an electronic one that hooks up to the computer, but it's not the same thing. So I don't buy dies and embossing folders and all that stuff. Because I don't have one, and even if I did, I probably wouldn't know how to use it anyway. So, um, I didn't get all of the fancy smancy stuff that, like, I mean, there was that Heartfelt Creations place, and I really, that's what I went there for, but I didn't buy anything from there because I went there to buy paper packs, and what I ended up doing was falling in love with stuff that I can't buy because I don't have the machine. So... I got over heartfelt creations. Not forever, just for today. Um, okay. So these were the Brads from the Brad place. These are cameras, rolling bags, airplanes, old fashioned model cars like the old Mustangs and the old Caddies and Edsels and all that stuff. And I just love that old stuff. It just needs to come back and stay. This is silverware. <laughs> real cute. They're all in dollhouse. These are little trees. So that's cute. This came as part of the free gift in the goodie bag hair clips. Mm. Um, I bought flares for the first time ever. Never those? had any. I just bought it because it says self. You see? Can you see that? Looks like Instagram. Can you see it? Can you stop talking and see what's going on in there? You can't see it? Papa. Okay, well, you need to tell me. Um, these also were from the goodie bag and because. Uh, the mister came with me we uh we did that and then i just got like these little things these creates and moments and stuff like that mm -hmm. and um these were from another bling store that i want i ugh, i don't even want to talk about that bling <laughs> store but they had the 50 cent early birth special and I was at another store buying their bling and I didn't know that these guys had the 50 cent special and if I would have known, I would have came and got all of these. But alas, I did not. Dun dun. So these were a dollar. Um, and then I got her from the same, isn't she so cute? Again, I don't do Halloween, but woo woo, Pampa Lula, isn't she cute? I bought this for a friend of mine because she's into Halloween, but she's adorable. Anyway, a witch. Um, also, I got these from Scrapbook Clothes Out. They're just uh, wood veneer words, inspirational words. I don't know. I think there's like 30 of them in here. Um, let me see. Let me see. Here goes more brads. These are candy corns. Can you see these? Mm -mm. These are candy. Yeah. Why are you back there if you're not going to tell me? Candy corns. Can you see them? Okay. These are not for me, though. <laughs> and okay so then i went to this other store what is this um uh, be creative nicole peterson no the stamps of life scrap book scrapping for less mona me gabby i don't remember what store these were from but they had like all these papers from different countries and and cities and states and stuff like that so of course i got puerto rico there i go <laughs> making that sound i don't know why i can't not make that sound um, cause we don't make that sound, but okay, we go whippa, whatever, what? <laughs> whippa, so Puerto Rico, mm -hmm. they had some other ones too, but they were not pretty, and some stickers, can you, can you see that, okay, stickers, and then, let me tell you ladies, um, I have for the first time decided to invest in Copics. So you guys are gonna laugh at me. At first I was gonna do these uh, Spectrum Noir ones. Can you see that? These were, they came free for the goodie bag. Um, so I went and I did the little make and take and she was great, she was awesome. She explained everything and you know, she it all made sense. And then she said that they were way cheaper than uh, 
That was my practice paper. That's so cute. That it was, they were way cheaper than the Copics and this and that and the other and all that good stuff. But um, in the end, I finally decided that if I'm going to spend the money on a huge collection of markers, it better be a collection of markers that I'm going to live with for the rest of my life. So I decided to do the Copics for the first time ever. I am embarking into a new universe. So I got these three. Uh, I, I can't even see those letters, so I can't even tell you what they are. I can. But you can see the colors. And then with these markers came this cool. Can, can you see this? You can. You're fired. Hey. Came this cool little booklet. This is embossed. It says my Copics, and it's like a bank book. <laughs> it's like a bank book. And then it has all the colors. See, ABC order. And all in ABC order. Right? And then you just mark off the ones you have. And I guess you can keep this in your purse or wallet or whatever so that when you go to the store, you don't buy the same ones twice. Um, so I only have three, but it's okay because I'm on my way. And then these things go with. Um, she did she was doing this demonstration on how to use the Copics on glitter paper and it was awesome and they use these as the stencils but I didn't get the glitter paper because because I just didn't get it because I have some around here somewhere so so this is all the stuff that I got I'm real happy yay Vicky send me a message and let me know which one of the mud puddles you want so I can get those off to you and um, if you guys are wondering what is this nasty like track mark on my arm no I have not succumbed to narcotics I was in the hospital the day before yesterday I was gonna get my gallbladder out mm. and I was so stressed out because I thought I was gonna miss the scrapbook let me tell you you know you're out of control when you're like I don't want to get my gallbladder out even though I'm in severe pain because I'm going to miss the scrapbook expo. And then I thought to myself, well, if they take the gallbladder out and there's stones inside of it, will they let me keep the stones so I can scrapbook them? So, you, like I said, therapy. Disgusting. It is disgusting, but I need therapy because this is what it is. All right, guys, I'm going to let you go. I don't know how long this video is, but my battery's dying and all that good stuff. So I will talk to you guys next time. Coming back to you with some more layouts and probably not a haul video for a long time because I bought a lot of crap. Okay, bye.